everybody's heard of malaria. If you imagine a billion people in the world essentially being influenced by this tiny thing that's flying around. So for us, the need finding was what is that one thing that we could almost distribute for free that starts to match um, the specificity of what detection requires. What came out of it is what we call use and throw microscopy. Uh, these little microscopes that are literally built out of paper, tape, and glue. And uh, they're as good as many research microscopes that you can buy. We've come very far to an instrument that we really can do uh, very sophisticated modalities of microscopy, but at a cost point where after one use you could throw the entire microscope away. It's completely flat. It's built by folding. The versions we have go all the way from bright field standard microscopes to fluorescence to dark field polarization. They don't require any power supply. They come as a complete unit. The cost for us for making something like this comes down to around uh, 55 to 45 cents. And so we're really stoked about handing this off to all kinds of people. Because in the end, there is both a training gap and an instrumentation gap. It's the community of health workers and the community that's physically out there day to day that's going to fill up the training gap. But what we're doing initially is providing them the tools to be able to do that.